Okay, now I'm gonna stay in the sh suppressed shooting, throw my Atlas and uh, bipod here, and throw in the 77 grain, and uh, see what she does at range. I don't, I haven't made a ballistic chart for this yet, so I'm just gonna use holdovers and uh, see where we go from there. But as you can tell from the suppressed, I don't know if you can see that or not. All the, all the dirt and stuff stays up front, or not dirt, but uh, gas, and gets it gets awfully hot. So, glove is very recommended. But look at how clean the bolt is, and it's cool to the touch. It's cold. Okay, I'm going to show you that 450 yards here. Sorry if you can't see the target, they need some fresh paint. I think I made a few hits out there. Uh, I'm gonna go out to this other, I think it's like 250 yards straight out. It's the one standing upright high. to 450 now again about 10 minutes out about eight minutes up Well, that was 100 rounds through it. Uh, I haven't done much for accuracy testing yet. I did a little uh, on the 55 grain American Eagle that I get at Walmart. That's like seven bucks a box. Hovers around two minutes. That was right on the box. It, hopefully that improves on break it, uh, breaking it in a little bit. 
But uh, the only thing I could get under a minute at sub MOA was a federal gold medal match at 69 grain. But I haven't tried a whole lot. And I haven't hand loaded for it yet either. But all in all, I'm pretty impressed with the weapon. And that's my favorite part. It's cool, just well lubed, and it's a little, little dirty yet, but that was 40 rounds suppressed pretty fast. If you guys want to see anything else, just let me know. Thanks for watching.